The preparation of a structural drawing is the last stage of the structural design. A structural drawing or a structural plan is composed of structural details and a general arrangement plan or layout necessary for site construction. In these drawings, all the details that we need to follow during site construction are being reflected. Although the preparation of the structural drawing is a structural draftsman's task, as a structural designer we should see to it that the proper drawing standard has to be followed and implemented. We all know that every detail of our design, minor or major shall be reflected accordingly in the drawing. Since we are the one who is responsible for the structural design, our guide to a structural draftsman is necessary in order to come up with a clear and easy to understand structural plans. This video will show you the basic requirements or the standard lists of structural drawings that are necessary for the preparation in accordance with the structural design. Although each of the proposed projects had very broad and specific details, somehow checklists or guidelines is very important to make sure that every part of the structural drawing has been accounted for. Here are the lists of structural drawings to be maintained. S101. General structural notes. S102. Structural typical details. S103. Structural schedules. Structural schedules includes schedule and details of beams, column, walls and slabs. S104. Shoring layout, if any. S105. Foundation plans, schedules, and section details. It may include isolated footing, combined footing, strip footing. Raft foundation. Pile and pile cap details. S106. Column layout. S107. Ground floor framing plans. S108. Typical floor framing plans. S109. Roof floor framing plans. S110. Wall section details. S111. Staircase details, and S112. Compound wall layout and details. The above mentioned lists of structural drawings are depending on how big the project is. You can omit the lists that you do not need and retain the others or you can either add another list that is necessary. It is the structural designer prerogative on how the approach will be. But be aware also for the drawing lists requirement of the authority having the jurisdiction that we need to consider. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe for more.